Welcome everybody. Welcome everybody and in this video cheat sheet we're going to be originating prefixes into BGP. We're first going to start off with some baseline show commands, show IP BGP and show IP interface brief. Then we're going to enable a debug command, debug IP BGP updates so we can see how the updates change as we originate the prefixes into BGP. And then we're going to finish up with the show IP BGP verification command to see how it differed from the baseline show IP BGP command. So let's look at the network topology. We're going to originate BGP prefixes here in Autonomous System 2 on Router 1 via the network command and then also originate BGP prefixes here in Autonomous System 3 on Router 7 via the redistribute connected command. So let's get started. I'm going to run these four show commands, show IP BGP, show IP interface brief, show run interface loopback 11 and 111 so that we can see what the network and the masks are in compared to what we're actually going to put into the router down here. All right. We still don't have any output in our show IP BGP command yet. Um, We've only done so far on router one, enabled the process, and hard-coded the router ID. So there, there, there's nothing there yet. With the show IP interface brief command, uh, we see that loopback 111 and 111 are interfaces here on this router. So we went in and actually looked at the interface itself. We did a show run interface so that we could see what the address is with the mask. So this is a slash 25 prefix mask and this is also a slash 25 prefix mask. If we look over here that actually coincides with what we're going to put in. So let's put this in. Before we do that let's enable debugging with the debug IP BGP updates command so that we can see how the updates change. So my two network statements are in, and as you can see, the the first loopback 11 prefix slash 25 is now up and is routing, and then the second 111 loopback address is now up and routing. So I'm going to turn debugging off, and now I'm going to do a show IP BGP and see if we finally get some output from this command and voila we finally do. We finally see that our local router ID is 1.1.1.1 that we hard coded in the last video cheat sheet but we didn't get any output from that because we didn't have any prefixes in BGP and we can see now that our two loopback addresses that we used with the network statements here and here are now in BGP with a next hop of 0.0.0.0, .0 which means it's being originated from this router. So let's go over to router 7 and do a small subset of that. But we're actually on router 7, we're going to be redistributing connected. Basically any connected route, so all of these, that's why we did the show IP interface brief because I wanted you to see what prefixes are actually going to be going into BGP, will be redistributed in. So we see that we already have two prefixes here from router 4 with the next top so there's already some adjacencies up and from router 6 here but let's go ahead and that's all that's in in BGP with the show IP BGP command so now we did a redistribute connected which once again should redistribute all these connected routes into BGP and let's see if that's what happened and it did. All of these interfaces that are directly connected, all these prefixes that are directly connected are now in BGP with once again a next top of 0.0.0.0, .0, .0 which means it was locally originated. It's being originated from this router. Those are two ways to originate prefixes into BGP. We did some baseline show commands, we did some debug commands so that we could see that the prefixes were being advertised, we originated prefixes into BGP with the network statement and redistributed connected.